And welcome back to Bros in a Landfill. Uh, new game today, uh, Captain Zubasa, Rise of New Champions. Uh, today um, we've got me, uh, Travian, and our Captain Tsubasa aficionado lunch. I d d have not seen the show, but I played soccer when I was a kid. Uh, so I feel uniquely qualified <laughs> to judge the quality of this game. Yep, indubitably. Like, if there's anybody that knows anything about soccer anime, it's 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 Lunch Billion. The, yeah, the, man. The sports, My childhood the sports, was a soccer anime. I just was so, one of the side characters that never did anything and always lost. That's nice. I believe it. So, <laughs> let me see. So, I've already um played through the the main story mode, which is Episode Sabasa, which goes through the middle school arc. Well, I think is it the middle school or high school arc, whatever. Um, of like the second main arc of the anime, but yeah, fuck that. We're not doing that. We're we're, we're doing our own um, making our own hero today. Um, All right, I forgot this was the thing. You can make your own boy. Yeah. Or girl. Yeah, so we're can gonna be a girl. God. I think it's a guy. It's it's an it's a boys league. This ah, is like in the seventies. I th this is like the seventies. I think so. Like. No, no, it's gonna fit into the story that they actually wrote. Yeah. So, okay. so we can train our own hero. Uh, and. Shit, like we can choose one of three schools. So it's Misashi, Toho, and I okay. am going to <laughs> break it down for me. Uh, without going into spoilers, uh, they lose, they lose, they lose. Um, uh, because you're not like, like I mean, <laughs> you're, that you know, these guys like are spoilers. Yeah, no well, spoilers, but here's who doesn't win the championship. Isn't it a show about who wins the championship? Yeah, I know. No, but like, it's, it's, this is a game about um, Tsubasa's um, school, and uh, none of these schools are Tsubasa's school. Um, I kind of want to just go down, and, or I kind of want to start off with um, Ferreno uh, for reasons. They got tight uh, shorts and big thighs, so. Um, yeah. Well, Ferreno, like, has, like the, the story with the captain like, and like, the manager is like, actually like, one of my, like, probably like, one of the, my favorite parts of the like, non, like, like, non main rival schools. Like, I guess I've said before, like on the anime cast when we talked about Captain Tsubasa, uh, Captain Tsubasa does a really good job of characterizing its main characters. And uh, Furuno is one of those schools where you're like, I don't know if I want Tsubasa to win. So, like, well, I'm convinced, yeah. dude. Let's go. So, uh, so we gotta furry, take furry school. Yeah, we gotta take we gotta take them all the way up. <laughs> um, so should we be a forwarder, a midfielder, mil 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 or defender? Uh, uh, when what, I was a kid, I was a defender. Uh, I so, believe it. I mean, you're you know. the defender of everyone. You're the defender of everyone's hearts. Uh, that's really. No, that was a hot defending thing to say. <laughs> oh shit, we got a name. We are ourselves. taller and paler than I would have imagined. All right, the name has to come uh, at the end, surely. Oh, we can be buff. Yeah. Well, for the defender, should we be buff? Like, you're pretty buff, aren't you? Uh, the you're also can't see me, so yes. You're you're also really tiny. You're like you're you're a tiny buff guy with okay. a massive head. <laughs> like that's. <laughs> okay. All right, all right. Um, and you've you've got some of that pigmentation because of your your, your heritage. So uh, that's I don't. Know. I can't, like, m on my view, the colors are not super yeah. accurate. Like, anything remotely white is just straight white. So you're going to have to decide for yourself what is... Uh, I think I think that's pigment brown. enough. I, I think that's that's brown enough. Sure. For me, it looks yeah. just as white as every other one. <laughs> Ooh, are those um, my shoulders? Or what's happening? This, this is like how, this is how you wear your, um, your, your, your uniform. Oh, okay. Yeah, um... If we can show off my massive, my massive shoulders and biceps, that's yeah. cool. Yeah, so we'll, yeah, def we'll do, definitely do Hugo style. Yeah. Uh, face. Oh, I see. So what are we looking at? This is, this <laughs> is my, my hair? No, no that's your face, how your face looks. Oh, oh man. Okay. As, your, your defining feature is your really, really large jowl. <laughs> my jowls. I actually, <laughs> like, okay. I mean, we don't have to make me, but personally, <laughs> like, I actually don't have the greatest idea of my, my face width because I've got long hair that always covers the edges of my jaw. That's true. And so... Well, I think that's... A, the framing I think that's is about it. All right. I think it's I'll about trust, accurate. I'll trust your judgment. 
I mean, I've, I've seen you on video camera and I've seen your YouTube channel where you sometimes post. I mean, for Pete's sake, we even have an avatar on our, on our, on, on our Discord we have. Um, oh, yeah, we have an actual I, yeah. photo of myself yeah. as, a, as an emote. Well, then, yeah, in that case, emote. you're very qualified for this. Yeah, I think that's about right. Let's look at your hairstyle. If we know anything about you, you're, you, are, you are known for your super duper long hair. It's true. Not, not that one. Not that one. That's, I mean, that's very nice, but that's not, there we go. That, that is, is 100%. I think this is the closest we'll get. Yeah, um, fuck. That and, then you, you've got, and then you've got straight. That's lighter than I expected right there. Huh. I, I'm not sure that's correct. Man. Well, I think this is the closest we're gonna get to your wonderful hairstyle. Oh, thank you. This is an amazing tribute. I'm glad that you got oh. my giant biceps in there. Yeah. Now we gotta figure out your eyes. Um. Hmm. There's lots of eyes. Not only is it like Jeez, what are my eyes? It's like what are my anime eyes? Because that's like a whole translation process. Yeah. I think that's about accurate. Yeah, I like that. No, that I, I can tell that they're a bit smaller. Uh, so I yeah, think that yeah. works. Yeah, I think this is what we need. No idea what this slide isn't doing. Uh, it's doing enough. Um, let's see. <laughs> I don't like the other side. <laughs> it's doing enough. It's like that's my face. <laughs> I can't make out. Yeah. The um, so, so what, what's your eye color? Uh, brown. Okay. Figure out a good brown. Um, the brightness is down on my screen, so like I'm, I'm really doing some guessing when it comes to the colors. Right. No, I'm, I'm uh, like, like a, I can make out like the doctor stuff fine, but like, like the outlines of my hair, but like my face and my shirt are the same color. <laughs> Oof. Uh, it's pretty yeah. funny. Um, yeah, I'm really trusting you with my visage. I know. For for, for so, the YouTube uh, audience. So like, how how bushy are your brows? Um, I think I've got decently thick brows. Um, okay, I think this is... Yeah. I think that's, that's about right. Um, I'm assuming that they're the same color as your hair. Uh, yes. Okay. You would be correct in that assumption. And now we gotta just figure out your nose. Okay, you're gonna want to go for one of the bigger noses. I have a nice... Uh, it, it's anime, so there won't be any, but... Uh, you know, I got a nice ethnic nose. A nice, uh... Indigenous fucking fucking nose. Uh, the... Yeah, those are two. I mean, do you want me to just take a picture of my nose and put it in the Discord chat right now, and you can put it up no, on I'm the good. screen? No, I'm I can re I can remember how it looks. There we go. Yeah. Oh, that's perfect. Sure. It's a me. That's this is Brett Billy in 101. <laughs> nah. Inside, I just kind of say I love character creators. This is the most fun I've had on a Let's Play in in a long time. Oh, I'm Ooh, glad. Are those fucking I'll Sonic be... shoes? Go back up. Go back up. Oh, that, those ones are also Sonic shoes. Go up. Go up. Go up. Hell yeah, Sonic shoes. Okay, I mean, we got our cleats. And we got our... Oh, I can't even... I don't know what the voice pattern is. Fuck, I'm going to have to... Voice pattern? Doesn't do the same. If you know anything about you, it's your very deep, deep voice. Oh. Well, I hope that one of these tiny oh, anime so boys has a deep voice. Yep. Uh, that was that was the closest one we were going to get. Um, and then, let's see. You don't wear glasses, but you uh, do sometimes no. wear sunglasses. Occasionally. Okay. Oh, that's pretty fucking cool. Yeah, let's that's go a, with that. <laughs> that's a cool motherfucker. Yeah. I think... No, we just got to name him. Um, Brett. <laughs> That's me. That is my name. Brett. <laughs> this is like the cooler anime version of you. Brett. Yeah, this is what I'm like. <laughs> this is my ideal. This is what I yeah. project out into the world in the hopes they will think it is true. Mm -hmm. Oh, so we're doing the Namco Bandai thing of like, or anime thing where it's like, oh, we gotta make friendships with people. Hmm. Shit. So who should we make friendships with? 
Um, I I, we're a defender, so we might want to be friends with a defender person. He seems like a. This guy here seems like he's got a like his boisterous energy might be a bit too much for me. <laughs> uh, if you give me like the first guy, I think he's just stoic enough that we'll make good sort of foils, but not too extremely. Mm. Like yeah, I respect his protagonist. focus and passion. Oh yeah, well I, I why the fuck it's... would I wouldn't I want to be friends with the uh, the main character? Huh. Apart from the fact that Frieza might kill me for his character development. Oh, okay, I see. So we actually become friends. Like, we haven't unlocked the other people. So there's all all five of those are people we can be working on our friendships right now. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Well, that's more like real life. I have more than one friend in real life. Yeah, you have two. I fucking swear. God! <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so I, I think this is good. Let's, um, let's just freaking just jump into this. Yeah, let's dive in. Let's kick some balls. Episode Mute Hero Furano. Oh, uh, that's the captain of um, the Furano um, <laughs> soccer team. He looks fierce. Andre Raba. Let's do this. Yeah, I have no idea what that says. Yeah, uh, freaking um, freaking freaking um, the audience can see it's basically just um, say like talking about like the history of Nakatsu and Toho Academy. Okay. <laughs> I think I think this happens out. This is, this takes place after um the main tournament that the Tsubasa's arc covers. Oh my God. This is your dad, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> I love the alternate universe in which my dad is just a larger version of me. Yeah. I know you can't read any of this. We'll just have to go back and watch the video and give us some watch time to understand what's happening. That's okay. I could just tell you what's happening and like you, you'll have to completely trust me. Uh sure. Of course. I like I like this. I like this dude. In real life, my dad is like a completely different color from me. Uh, completely different body type, completely different hair. Um, not even remotely similar. But in this nice. universe, like, people just have... Well, this is anime, so like, people look just like their, their parents. Like, and they have the same haircut from like, childhood to adulthood. I believe it. So uh, is this fucking soccer simulator or soccer management yeah. simulator? Um, soccer, soccer, soccer simulator. You play, you play on the team. I feel like a, I don't trust this guy, even though he looks exactly like me. I mean, that's that's kindly kind of how I felt, except he doesn't look like me. <laughs> he definitely, he definitely has like anime villain vibes to him, he's even sinister, though he's not anime. You know? He's got these big shoulders and the glasses. He takes soccer very seriously, you know? Mm. That's just sometimes what happens. Sometimes so what's going on right now? stare deeply so what... into soccer and join the dark side. Sorry. Yeah, so what's going on right now is that the French International Tournament was cancelled. So, like, they're um, COVID, man. figuring out what to do. So they're, they're going to be setting up their own international tournaments, which is cool, I guess. Good. That's great, uh, Tatsuo Mikami, and um, yeah, you, you can read that enough. The, the text is clearer now than it was before. I don't know what's oh, cool. changed. And that's Maybe it's just easier. Than Masa Karagiri. Yeah, close enough. So I'm, I'm hoping we can get through at least one match on here, and then like for, for this recording, just to show it off, and we can see about continuing this. Um, let's play if we want to. Sure. Cause I don't even. We might get to the game, but he would be like, "Oh my God, try it. This is. I don't want to sit through, uh, 13 episodes of it. It's not trippy enough, like monkey balls." Well, all right. I mean, it's a little insecure of you to like pull out the oh, you stupid voice when I haven't even said anything yet. <laughs> I'm sorry, but just monkey ball is just that much superior to any other video game. Stop sounding exactly like me. It's creepy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, oh, this is an anime cutscene? Anime cutscene? Oh cool. 
Well, that means we can't show up in it. Because no one knows how to draw us. <laughs> I'm guessing this... Uh, uh, I'm guessing this is David Pro, given that they did the Kevin Tsubasa anime in it, but... I don't think David Pro typically does things for anime. Hmm. Yeah, for video games, that is. Who's this guy? Don't know. They're just random soccer players? Yeah, well, I mean, they're, they're oh, part of the Ferno. Oh, uh, I know I'm not pronouncing any of this right. I like that shot of the, the feet just now. Yeah. Don't say that, take that out of context. <laughs> wiki, like, we're gonna have um, wiki feet, but for high school, well, for middle school soccer players. That seems like it I mean, get you like taken down by the FBI. <laughs> Sounds about right. I mean, there, there's one thing you can say about like um, soccer players is that they're on their feet a lot, so they they must have some really buff feet. Buff feet. I guess so. like the f how much the feet get buff. Do we have a scientific consensus on this? Oh. I mean, like the Muay Thai fighters have like big feet because they kick people a lot, or or like is it just their whole body in general is like in good shape, and so there's not much fat on it? Yeah, I believe it. Yeah, that sounds right. that sounds exactly what happened to me. <laughs> sounds exactly like your your muscle foot story. Yep, exactly. Alright, well maybe on a future podcast episode we'll talk about Tri's muscle foot story of how he became a small foot man. Uh, spoiler alert involved Boy Scouts and a lot of hiking. God, I actually cannot wait for this story. Yes. The, the rising through the foot ranks and everything. I have no idea what's happening in this game, by the way. <laughs> it's okay, it's, it's, it's just exposition. Like Everyone looks very about. serious. Oh. Oh yeah, no, Captain Zabas is a bear. like, despite like the like really goofy cartoony aesthetic, it's a they they take soccer so seriously, it's not even funny. Like, like Zabasa literally like like okay, so like it, it does the trope where like people like are putting their lives on the line for playing middle school soccer. It's actually oh, like awesome. it's like it's like Zabasa is like. Oh, like, uh, the doctor comes up to the boss, it's like, you could seriously injure yourself and stunt your development, and you might never be able to play soccer again if you keep if you keep playing this match, and then the boss is like, yeah, but I have to keep playing this match, otherwise I will regret it forever. You full Tsubasa, you gotta think about the longevity of your career. You can't throw everything away uh, now just to, because, I've like, gotta, uh, you'll lose one time. Losing's I've part of your win. development, oh, I've Tsubasa. I've gotta win this tournament! I've gotta win this tournament so I can go to Brazil! To become a pro soccer player. <laughs> Your drive is going to be the thing that not only propels you, but the thing that burns you up in the atmosphere, Subasa. You're going too far. It's, it's funny. It's funny you say drive because that's a special shoot. Um, like shoot is called the drive shot. So yeah. like, like it's he's full of drive and he he makes the ball spin really fast and go crazy places. Like. Captain so Tsubasa, especially like the 2016 anime, is like just super hype. And going through the story mode on this, um, for the Tsubasa arc, um, a lot like unlocking like the scenes from the the source content, like so like when you're through the story mode, you'll have these points where if um, certain people have the ball and there's certain conditions met, um, the actual like events from the main story will start happening mid match. Right. Like it'll be like a CG cutscene, and it's so fucking hype just like seeing it again like like you're in the middle of a match and just all of a sudden this epic thing triggers it's, it's something cool about um these anime games is that like they are like they're so about like kind of fan service and um like like if it were a normal game like there'd be no reason to add something like that it'll be completely arbitrary and strange but like yeah it's for fans of the show and they can yeah like recreate that moment and be like fuck yeah this is awesome like, like, it's part of why, um, I don't know, like, I really like in, in, like, the Dragon Ball Z games on PS2, like, they would throw in, like, the most completely random characters, like, you know, Vegeta's dad and, like, some random Frieza soldier. And, like, again, if, if, if this game was, like, its own property, why would you have those? 
but as like a super fan, you're like, oh, what if I got Vegeta's dad to fight some random Freezer soldier? This is so cool. You know, it's like playing with toys and your action figures. Um, and it's, it's like a vehicle to like explore your love of, of the show more so than it is to just be a game, uh, which, you know, has some flaws, but it also is kind of cool in its own way. Um, yeah. So right now they're um, introducing um, the expedition for oh new transfer student who's this cool kid that's going to join our um, soccer team for this amazing tournament coming up. I feel like we do not need this much dialogue to establish that a new kid's joining the soccer team. Yeah. Ooh, is it time to see also, us? It's all. Stop. <laughs> Stop. This kid's oh, man, a fucking you, you, you. baller. I know, fucking hell, this is, man, I'm, I'm just glad, like, the, the designers in this game just had all the correct options to make the character look exactly like you. <laughs> it's amazing how far technology's come in 2020. I know, it's, uh, it's practically like a, it's like basic, pra practically a face capture of you. I'm this fucking squat gremlin, like, let's kick some balls. <laughs> just walking in here in my shades, I don't know. It's awesome. Feel the power of breath. Red. <laughs> right. Oh, cool. Sometimes you get to talk with custom player in game. I oh, fuck. Oh. Cool. So, um, defender, right? Uh, so we know that this guy is a fucking Chad. Yeah. So... Can you just answer in the chattiest way possible on every one of these? Because okay, so. So she'd be like, wow, you actually remember your nice to meet you, dot, dot, dot. I th it's clearly not nice to meet you, dot, 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 given just how much of a Chad you are. You know, like, you're just cool as a bean. Yeah, <laughs> whatever, kid. I'm like the same age. Oh, All right, oh, yeah. let's do it. Let's do it. Do this. We got some I would love if, if some like ultimate Bros on the Landfall fan were to deep fake my face onto that character. <laughs> no, but we get like big and like a while like in a while, just think about that. Let's just start the match. Just jump right into it. Does any YouTube channel have like a fan base so good that that deep fakes come out of it? I don't think so. <laughs> Uh, that's that's uh, our resolve. Gonna... That's our ambition. That's our Subasa fucking huh. Nemdo. I, I want to see this. I want to see this deep fake on Tabakami Tai. Just because that, that meme will always be amazing. Is that that song? Yeah, from Yakuza. That's Dame a really Dame. fucking good meme. Dame yo. That's one of my Dame favorite Dame memes Dame. in a really long time. I saw oh, a really cool. good so, Smash Brothers can... one where Donkey Kong jumps off the stage with Captain Falcon and the camera switches like below him and they're falling and he's fucking singing and it's Donkey Kong and I can't describe it, it's great. This is soccer! Dude, this is way more exciting than like a second ago. I know, right? You got actually pe people running around on the field. Well, like, I like the sense of speed and intensity, like, and like the smoke and like the fucking, like, like compared to realistic soccer games, it's it's I don't know, it's really neat. Yeah, no, it's. I hope I don't know when we'll actually unlock like any like of the special like shots in this game. Oh shit, that was cool. See, it, this is like a uh, refreshing because like usually games like this are like a mediocre 3D arena brawler, and this you can't do that with a soccer game. It would be weird. Unless it was like a soccer riot simulator. But I don't know if soccer players really get into riots. Uh, this game is fucking... Like, these characters are like freaking brutal. Lives are on the line, man. Like, Mortal Kombat. I can get the body. I think Matsuyama has a um, special shot that I can... Oh, we haven't even seen Brett yet on the field. I mean, there's no way I'm gonna spot him like from, <laughs> from from my end. But you know, it's like, uh... oh shit! Oh my god! 
That was the coolest the thing intense. I've ever seen. Yeah, especially like in a soccer game. Yeah, dude. That was rad. I need to watch this show. Yeah, no, yeah, it's it's great. Like, it's it like keeps you on the edge of your seat. I think like the, the final the final um, match in the second arc is some of the hypest like sports shit I've ever seen. Sick. I wish I knew how the, some of the activation criteria for some of these. You tell me you haven't been like fucking up all night on Captain Tsubasa, the video game, the wiki. You know, in preparation yeah, it's for this. It's fucking Brett. Brett's going in for the steal. Oh, that's right. I'm a defender, of course. Oh yeah. That was cool. All right, right. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Let's kick that motherfucking ball. I'm on the edge of my seat, dude. Oh no! Though I guess this means we're going back to where Brett is, so that's pretty cool. Oh, there was just Brett, Brett just went up for the steal up there, but no, no we're getting. I pushed ahead. I didn't keep formation with the team. That was pitiful. Uh, you can't really see like what's happening. Oh, there's a map. I got it. Yeah, um, the, the map being down there is actually like really difficult to keep focus on. Right, I guess because of like how the ca where the camera is and where it moves and how like fast oh, everything shit. is. The V zone. What? You can't uh, so kick they, they, players they... in the V zone. <laughs> it's not God allowed. Damage. Sorry, this is what I'm like constantly. I understand. <laughs> I put the. Don't worry, I'm in the V zone now. Oh, congratulations, man. <laughs> I want to freaking pull this shot off. A lot of people wish they could get to the V zone. Uh, do it! Motherfucker! Hey! That was awesome. Yeah! He's really happy for getting a hit in, in a practice game. I know. Like, that was cool as no. hell. Yeah, no, no, I completely agree. Like, yeah, I love um. This game gets a yes, please from Lunchabillion. <laughs> Give it to me. So long. Oh shit, I just threw it all the way across. Oh, I, I think I got it, I got it. Oh, cool. Yeah. Uh, I headed to Masahiro Sakurai. That's uh... That guy should not be playing soccer. That guy should be sitting down, having a rest. Maybe getting a massage. I, I don't believe that Sakurai could, could play like a sport for more than two minutes without like snapping a bone. Oh, sweet match complete. That was the match. There was no half time. There was no. Uh... Oh, that, that, I mean, that was a scrimmage. What the fuck is a scrimmage? It's a practice game, you know. Like they're they're playing against themselves. Uh... <laughs> I think I just oh, used man, to call I... that practice and not a. That's not some bullshit made-up word. Yeah. Nice, no retry bonus. I didn't. Ha I didn't have to retry that. Mm. Yeah. Well, did I? Uh, did I level up? Did I gain experience? Yeah. Look at those. Look at those stats going up. Am I? Did I make it onto Captain Subasa's team? No, we're, we're we're a rival team to them. Oh, uh, you know the anti Subasa. Yeah. Jeremy. Well, I mean, team. you're not their, you're not their pure rival. You're just like close enough. It's a girl character. Yeah. But yeah, so we, we've clearly proven ourselves. And I can use her out. That's awesome. Yeah, I kicked the ball once or twice. Uh, I mean, we wouldn't need the help of. <laughs> 
Whoa. This will uh, be a cinch with me here. Terrifying. Yeah, let's see. Let's, this will be a cinch with me here. Yeah. <laughs> freaking Brett, that freaking Chad. I know how to kick balls. Yeah. He knows where the cow, where to kick well, how to kick balls where it hurts. Into the goal. <laughs> Alright. So how long are we where are we going for the first episode? I think is, is I that think a good this place is it to leave off? Yeah, that's a good place to leave off. We just finished our first match. Well that was fun. Yeah. I thought that was neat. Yeah, no, I thought, I thought it was fun. Yeah. Hey guys, thanks for definitely... thanks for watching um our soccer game and also my birth. Yeah. Yeah, if you like if you like what you saw here, like and stuff, please um go go check out the Captain Tsubasa anime, even though there's no legal stream of it anywhere right now. Like really? you, you, that's that's you can't no, I am I am Crunchyroll this like, shit? No, like seriously, like I I half expected the Captain Tsubasa 2016 anime, like well, 2018 anime to get like one of those like kids dubs, like oh like to do for like Digimon or something. It's like oh it'll just be one of those things because it has like it has like kid appeal since the first arc takes place in elementary school. Yeah. But no, like I mean we might get something like in like a few years maybe. You never know how licensed work. It's just weird to have this David production anime not get licensed, though. And then again, that could also be related to the rights holders of Captain Tsubasa, so I don't... No. Maybe but it's, a sh it's COVID-19 ruining everything. Ah. Man, why does COVID-19 have to be the best soccer team right now? Like, come on. Yeah, it's, it's dominating. It's dominating all the soccer yeah. fields. Yeah. Oh, anyways, yeah, this has been... Bros in a landfill, kicking balls, having a good time, you know? Entering that fee zone. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, see you next Signing time, off. guys. Uh, bye.